live or actually you guys are live everybody else is watching this on youtube at some point in time but for us live now game number one of the world series of three the beer keggers hosting the wide loads so we're at the uh what is it, auto stadium something like that the home of the beer keggers and uh, our uh, team is taking the field here. Pitching for us, Chris Dirt Bagus in the wide loads. Have Marsha Donga, 375 average, no homers, one RBI coming up to bat first. Dirt Bagus is ready to go, ready to rock. Watch the first one go home run. Nope, she swings and misses. Dirt Bagus throws a changeup. Going way on the outside there for ball number one and one strike. She does hit that in the air. Hey guys. But it goes back out behind this into the stands there behind the fencing. So he can't get it. He's gonna get a piece of that. Reliable's running up. And he slides in, but uh oh no! Just like I thought. Uh reliable picks it up and <laughs> he slid into it. My fault there, Modder. I didn't you know, I tried to do some amazing catch, but uh he came in uh, butt first and came a little shy of that one. If I would have left it alone, you probably would have caught it. So now we got no outs. We got a runner on second. Dirtbag is pitching to Darcy Hicks. First one goes foul right behind. Uh, zero, all zeros in the postseason here. What's happening? I don't know. Just play a little baseball. That's a strikeout for Dris, uh, Chris Dirtbag. That's out number one. Harmony Strauss, 250, one homer, three RBIs in the postseason. Uh, their catcher. Watches the first one curve on the outside and then right over the plate for a strike. The second one curves opposite on the inside. Strike number two. Dirt bag is on a roll. That one goes out to balls. That's out of the park easily. The bullpen is just sitting there. Almost they didn't try to catch it. Go so home run on Chris Dirt Bagus. Putting two on the board for the wide loads as Strauss taps the plate and uh, shakes everybody's hands here. We got the blonde bombing mustache man of Hack Liner. Hack Liner. Liner, 412, two home runs, 10 RBIs. That's just in the postseason. So this guy, uh, well, he's a threat. Aaron Big Sauce dies for it. Reliable's running out to it. And uh, that's gonna be, he reaches down and picks it up. Sends it off to second again. So it looks like the beer keggers are facing something unusual here in the championship. And that is uh, the balls are being not easy to catch, apparently. We haven't changed anything. It is exactly the same level it's been all season. But this is the championship caliber team we're facing. Dirt Magus hits, uh, throws that one in, and it goes. Is Kurt going to get it? No, it goes over the fence. Now with two strikes, one out, runner on second. That goes out of bounds, curving. Foul ball, strike two. Chris is gonna send that one outside. He's not fooled there. Uh, that's Chimo Gasper, by the way. I don't think I said his name yet, the shortstop. Now we're at uh, two and two. Mariana goes to catch it and uh, can't quite get to it. I don't know why that's considered fair. That doesn't make sense. It landed out of bounds, even though she now missed it. The center fielder. I, I, I don't understand why that one's considered fair. Normally it's not fair. It landed on the ground outside of the uh, fair ball line. So, is what it is. DC Roberts, what's up, man? That goes to Capali on first. Gonna t I tap it. I try to. Try to get Sidewinder to tap first base and throw it to second. Didn't quite work out that well. Hey, TC, right above you, we got uh, Mr. Reliable in here, live in person. Dirt Baggis throws that one a little too much on the inside there for ball number one. That's a swing and a miss. There's two outs, runner on second. Now two strikes as that one goes foul, clear out of the stadium. Same with that. Now Dirt Baggis says be careful. That one gets clipped straight up in the air. It looks like Rusty's run for, he's calling for it. That makes it out number three. So at the top of the first inning, the White Loads did manage to put three up on the board. A weird spot for the Keggers to be in. But now it's their turn. 
They're sending Big Slick, Brandon Balls, and Dirty Kurt, the first two up to bat for the beer Dirty cutters. Ball. The left fielder, number 74. All right, 74. He does have one homer in the postseason, seven RBIs. He's going to smash that one foul. He swung a little bit of late on that one. That one too early. Now he's sitting at two strikes. Right over, not over the third baseman. Third baseman stretches out and pulls that one in. This is not a multiplayer match. This is the championships that we've been uh, building up to all year. Uh, multiplayer is gonna be coming. So if you guys have this, uh, it is one of the uh, selections we have now. It just came out, there's a patch the other day. Dirty Kurt. So excited about playing multiplayer, hits that one straight up and out to the right fielder for out number two. Now Frogman Barbarian is the last hope of the first inning. That's on the inside for ball number one. That's gonna be strike, but it comes in on the inside, so he lets it go. He'll punch that one down, that goes foul. That's strike number two. Same thing as he had to hit that one, that would've been a strike. Well, that one he just tips on the inside of the bat. Gasper. Throws it to first base for easy out number three. The beer keggers, zero. Bomb in the first. Hello, Roids will be the first up for the wide loans as my voice cracked there, getting a little too excited. And uh, we uh, may just end up finishing the right this season here Elroy. and figure out who the championship is. So this could be a double or triple header depending on how the, the whole thing plays out. But we'll see what goes on. Darren Big Sauce dives for it. Reliable, dives for it as well. And uh, he goes back and picks it up, throws it off the second, the runner. Well, everybody's getting doubles. This is not usual for us. This team is uh, definitely a challenge for the beer keggers. Wade Hobbs, the runner on second, no outs. Their left, uh, left fielder, bottom in the order, takes the first one as a strike. Second one, strike as well. Back out for Dirtbag, that's 86 miles per hour. He doesn't even bother swinging at it. So now we're back at the top of the order for the wide lows. Got Donga with the one RBI. She did score, I believe. Uh, takes first one as a curveball, which was a strike. That hits just the corner, the corner of the plate. He does get a piece of that one, but sends it foul, so it remains. Two strikes, no balls. And a swing and a miss. Strikeout number two in a row for Chris Dirt Vagas. Darcy Hicks is back for some more. Did not get on base. His last at bat. I don't think he was. He's a designated hitter too, but I don't think he was a strikeout. That comes in as a strike there on the inside. Correction, that was the outside, but it was high. This one also going high. Darren Big Sauce coming off second out to catch it. Out number three. The defense for the beer keggers kicked in, holding wide loads to no run scored at the top of two. We're at the uh, <laughs> number, the fourth, there's three up, three up, three down last time for the beer keggers and Kung Fu Beer is gonna be the first one to probably start that trend at the bottom of two. 609, four homers in the postseason, nine RBIs as well. Right down the middle, KFB just lets that one go. He hits the higher one. Uh, it looks like it's a floater. They're going to catch it. Yes, they are. Akuro at center pulls that one in. Now his son, 591, one homer postseason, seven RBIs postseason. With one away. Rusty Edge. Down the third baseline, but it goes, he hooks it foul. Let's that one go. It didn't curve enough. Right down the middle. That puts Rusty on first. Better Phil will pick it up and throw it to second base. Now we finally got somebody on base. So I wonder, Capelli, everyone, 500 average, two homers back to back in like two games ago, 11 RBIs for Capelli. That one comes too much on the inside. She lets it go. Strike number one. Oh, almost swung at that. I actually pushed the button, but it did not react. Capelli hits that one right out to right field. Beer Kegers just getting warmed up as usual. 571 average for Beer. Uh, one homer, three RBIs postseason for her. 
So that puts her at 571. Smashes that one. Oh, right to the shortstop who is unable to pick it up. Uh, Mariana tries to head to second, but Rusty's standing there, so she does Bill not proceed. And uh, Darren Big Sauce 15. steps up to the plate two way, two runners on. Ah, that's on the inside of the base uh, as a bat there. So that's an easy. Big Sauce does not have the speedy wheels there, so he doesn't make it the first. So still nothing for the beer keggers. Top of the third, wide loads are sending up for the second time. Harmony Strauss, who has a home run so far in the game. Now batting, the Locked in and Harmony doing well. Strauss. Loves that outside pitch. 294, two home runs, uh, counting the last one inside of the, the playoffs. Kurt Bagus throws a curveball there on the inside. He does uh, go for that one. It looks like Kapowie and Dirty Kurt are running for this. Who picks it up? Looks like Kapowie. Out number one. The third baseman. The Linner's back. One for one double. Uh, quite a impressive record. Kurt Bagus sends that one a little high. That's ball. Goes right out to Reliable. Who picks it up sliding this time and catching it. Sends a second for a base hit. Now batting, the Chimo Gaspar. Chimo Gaspar. 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 However you say it. He's uh, going to let that first one come in high. Her bag slides that one in there a little low, but it is in the zone. As is that one. Going to be on the outside. Back out. He's like, what? What? He's looking down for where the ball would have went, but he never hit it. So Kiro, 267, no homers, no RBIs. Center fielder there has a lot of action today. Watch the first one come in strike. Swing and a miss for strike number two. The bag is going to throw something here as a slider, and he gets it to Beer. He's going to pick it up, throw it to second. That's uh, easy. Wow, I, I'm surprised we made it. Uh, we were going to go for a double play, but it was already two outs. So, again, the beer caggers hold uh, high on the defense list there. The strategy of defensive play, finally. Zero for the white loads. Now Mr. Reliable's up. 650 average, one homer. I believe he's leading the team in the uh, batting average. Of course, that could go to shit right now. He lets the first two go by a little high. Ball. Punches that there right out to the left fielder shot. Securely puts him on first base. Starting off good for Reliable. The left fielder, well, Big Slick, uh, he popped out his last at bat. So back to the top of the order for the beer keggers. Reliable's on first. That's a bouncer off the, right off the mound there. So Reliable goes to second, turns around, goes back. Uh, instead of going to third, which was fine. Big Slick for the base hit. Now two on. Hey guys. Dirty Kurt. Oh, that's right over second, but he'll catch that. Or over shortstop, I should say. So out number one is Dirty Kurt. Doesn't it hit her? Frogman Barbarian. Two on. He does have a homer in the postseason. He could have hit that one, but he let it go by. That one he did not wisely. He almost swung at it. Too high for him. He loves him, though. Ah, if I would have slowed down and hit that one, timed it better. Yeah, I had to hit that one. That was coming in as a strike, but it's slow. That one's slow as well. All right. Come on, Barbarian. That's a little high. Full count. And he walks. Barbarian with a walk. Unusual. I thought that was going to be a strike. Base is loaded. One out. Kung Fu Beer's here to cause some sort of triple play, most likely. He lets that first one go by. Not too excited of the situation. That's right over the middle there. Strike number one. That goes to second. Here's the, here's the double play I told you. Just like that. Ruined. He could have hit a grand slam. It's happened. But no, he, he hits a double play. Three and zero. 
top of the fourth. Your keggers have to do something. They have to hold their defensive uh, stance here. And then they're going to, uh, you know, going to need to do something spectacular. Catch up. It's happened. That's going to be strike right there. Nope, that's, high. that's going to be a little high. Oh, that's going way over foul. All right, let's see what we got. Liable's going to get it. Let's throw it to second. Base hit. Now batting the right fielder, Ella Roy. All right, so. Ball inside. Ball is going to be inside. Ball number one there. Got a runner on first. Her bag is starting to throw him uh, everywhere that he shouldn't. There's a uh, connection, but it is foul, so that's a strike. strike. Strike two. Two up. Strike three. And that's another strikeout for Dirt Bagus. Now batting the left fielder, Wade Hobbs. Now we got uh, Wade Hobbs. Wow, the dude's feeling all rattled. He is not ready to play here. But he is ready to swing. So he swung a little too slow on that one. That one also, hmm, I guess, was that be a little fast to hit it foul down the line there. So Dirtbag is going to do something tricky. Strike three. Strike three. It's out number two for Dirtbag. Is. The first baseman, Masha Dunga. Masha Dunga. Masha Dunga. One RBI postseason. Uh, first baseman. First of the order. Two outs. Runner on first. Your bag of sends that one on the outside there. Too high. He hits that one. That puts it at two strikes now. One ball. Oh, that goes right over everybody's head. It looks like nobody's in a big rush to get it. So uh, reliable will throw that. Oh, no. How they, what? Big sauce. Fails to pick it up, and the runner now goes home. Now four to zero. Darcy Hicks. Designated hitter. He struck out, uh, I believe, his last at bat. That goes straight in the air. Hey, guys, I got this. Bernie Kurt, out number three. So the defense still held decently, except the... Uh, the play that happened that caused the error for the run four at the top of four for the wide loads and now the beer keggers have rusty coming up first now batting the right fielder number 17 loves that inside pitch but he'll take that one. Oh, is that gonna go no nope. off the wall the rusty only gets a single out of it Another couple feet, it would have been out of here. The first baseman, number 13. However, here's Kapowie. I think the fan club is falling asleep here. Yeah. All right, let's that first one kind of curve. He'll hit that one, though. That puts her on first base, and that uh, puts Rusty on second. All we need is base hits. Now Mariana Beer, who Number did uh, tap out her last, one. or popped out, not really a tap out. Oh, there's a double play coming, let's bear it. Nope, she's not gonna make it. But Rusty does advance now the third base. The so uh, Kapowie forced out at second. Uh, Mariana didn't get a good shot on it. And I don't, uh, that's big sauce. And that's not gonna be a big hit. Oh yes, it is. It barely cleared the wall. And Big Sauce with the home run puts two on the board at 426 feet, his third of the postseason. And now Reliable is gonna come up. Now with uh, the Beer Kegers now only trailing by two. Manley was out there rooting for Sidewinder, by the way, when that, uh, oh, that's right in the shortstop's hands there. Out number three, the lead is now split in half by the beer keggers. 
The wide lows, top of five, have Harmony Strauss. One for two with a home run, though. Now batting the catcher, Harmony Strauss. Usually catching. Today she's been hitting, at least half the time. That goes right to Beer. I'll pick it up, go to the first, hopefully, if he can make it. And he does. Now batting the third baseman. Linner's two for two. He seems to be sending them out to reliable, kind of like between center and right today. I'm not sure if uh, Reliable's paying attention. He's moved over a little bit or not. Kurt Bagus is not gonna, he's not gonna, he's gonna try to keep it in his uh, in his hands there. Uh, Reliable's headed back towards the wall. He stops, turns around, catches it for out number two. So he was paying attention. Gaspar, one for two, 400 average now. Bagus sends that down a little too low, but it looks like he had a clear something out of his mouth that's probably what happened right. and he cracks that one with a strike there one and one right. that's a fast one Gaspar is not fast enough that one he hits it goes into a lucky fan out uh, by the first baseline that one goes straight in the air as well Otter's calling for it already the confidence pulls that one in out number three no runs for the wide loads finally beer keggers Top of the order, Big Slick up first, and Dirty Kurt will follow. Now batting the left. So Big fielder, Slick's average has fallen significantly over the last two games. He's down to a 400 average now. That's not going to help him as he hits it right out to center fielder. Akuro pulls it in easily. The catcher. Dirty Kurt's down to 520, so he's been up and down throughout the season. I think this is the highest he's been. Uh, but he's 0 for 2 so far today. Goes down the uh, first baseline right into the, the right fielder's mitt. Out uh, about 320 inches shy of the wall. Barbarian watches the first one come in as a strike right down the middle. Oh, I thought I was gonna hit him like in the in the face there. Redneck Leo with the follow, thank you so much. Looks like Barbarian's crossing first, headed to second right now. He's gonna slide, no, he's gonna stand up because it's far away. He started to go to third, he probably would have made it, but thanks to my luck, uh, they never seem to. Pierce sitting at 0 for two on the day, which is unusual for him, but I mean, it is what it is, there's two outs. That's right off the dirt. He lets that go by. He'll hit that one, unfortunately, but it did go foul, thankfully. So one strike, one ball, two outs. That's as well, that's some sort of funky curveball there. Ooh, I pushed the button. I'm thankfully it did not connect. No, oh, that's a high ball. That's an easy out. Beer loves those. And he ruined that one. Again, the score. The first game of the World Series, first of three, the Beer Kaggers are trailing by two, top of the six. Now batting, the wide the loads fielder. have the center Fungo, fielder, Akiro. 250 average, he's coming up first. He has no home runs or RBIs in the postseason, but that could change any minute as we've all seen. As soon as I start talking smack, they're gonna hit it out of here. First, uh, the second wall goes strike, first one was a ball. Your bag is starting to throw them all over the place. Hero hit that one no matter where it went. Oh, the strikeout for Dirt Bagus pulled him. 11 swings and doesn't pick up any of the uh, any of the hints that were coming his way. So a strikeout for Dirt Bagus. One away now. Trying to burp there, so I sent that one too high. Did that one and one. Big Sauce, uh, I don't know what he was doing there. We got two people running for it. Otter's gonna pick it up, second sec, sends it to second base. For, it rolls in for like 20 feet. The beer picks it up. Ella Royds. One out, runner on first. No homers, no RBIs for Ella. 143 average is not very good. Doesn't matter. Home run coming, almost always. Nope, 
All right, Dirtbag is just throwing balls here. Wrecks that one, throws a strike there on the outside. That goes in the inside right into the dugout. And that a little bit high. Oh, a strikeout again. Their bag is just throwing them all day long. How about it? The left Here's Wade Hobbs. Wade Hobbs. Uh, struggling with contact right now. He's rattled. So, your bag is going full speed. Didn't hit that one. And that one a little bit lower. That one goes to Beer. Oh, no, Beer can't get it. What the hell? I think he was already looking at first base now before back. it rolled to him. So, okay, so Hobbs is out. I don't know if he, he got, he's rattled, so they're sending Izzy Baker to pinch run for him. So we can expect a steal coming here. So Dirty Kurt has to be paying attention, ready to roll. As soon as we hear the uh, crack noise of them stealing, we'll try to get it in there. All right, that's that's going to nobody. That's that's just everybody's hitting out there today. It's weird. That's two runs scored for these piece of shits. Wide loads. Now batting, the filling up the toilet with all their garbage Darcy right now. Hicks. Darcy Hicks is zero for three so far, but there's probably a home run or triple coming as soon as they hit it out there. Uh, oh, I don't know what that was. I wasn't aiming there. Uh, Dirt Bagus is falling apart quick. Right. Got to uh, maybe finish out this inning if we can get it. Okay, that goes to Big Sauce. He's going to throw it to first. Yeah. Uh, out number three. Sawyer almost dropped it. And Dirt Bagus finished us off with uh, two runs on the injury list. Beer Kegers have Rusty Edge. Two for two so far. The right fielder. 625. Number He's. Going to be facing, uh, well, let's see. We had a new fielder. Izzy's leaving and uh, Prince Prize coming in at left field. Rusty. Oh, well, he sends it. Uh, the shortstop dies for it. And Rusty makes it to first. Now that, the first baseman, number Diwinder Kapowi, one for two. The last one she was on base, but she got forced out at second. Let's that one go by low on the outside for ball number one. That's on the inside for ball number two. Sidewinder Kapowi fan clubs getting all heated up. Sidewinder hits a beauty there, goes out to center, so that puts her on first. Who's Rusty up to second? No outs. Mariana Beer. He's uh, falling behind in this game, 522, 0 for 2 on the game. That comes right down the middle of the plate. Strike number one. Nope, Too high, so she lets that one go for ball. She's gonna smash that one. Oh no! Prince comes sliding in, modern hinky style, but he picks it up, whereas Modder didn't earlier. So Mariana doesn't quite make it. And then here's Big Sauce. Uh, last one was a home run. She lets that one float over the top, outside high for ball number one. That curves in uh, just in time for strike number one. He's gonna hit that one. That's, uh, is that going? Yep, it is. Big Sauce is running to second. And uh, looks like, uh, oh, is that Kapowie? Yeah, Kapowie started head home. She's not very fast. So uh, everybody's like, no, no, no. Well, she heads back to third. Now here's Reliable. Oh, he hit that high one. Ball, high. ball too high there. One and one. He hits that one to second base. Uh, okay, well, so Reliable sacrificed himself so Powie could get off of the field, scoring a run. Again, closing the gap there, now trailing by two. Here's Big Slick. Right through the pitcher, so Big Slick goes to first. And that's another run. Now it's one point behind the wide loads for the beer catchers. Now that, the catcher, to the rescue, Steve Dirty Kurt, who's nine. 0 for 3 of the game. Big Slick's getting a healthy lead. And uh, Kurt swung, I don't know, like an hour too early. Off the plate. 
All right, that one's not off the plate. It's on the outside there. So Kurt smashes this one, but it's not going to have the distance, I don't believe. So Kurt goes to second. Uh, he's going to third now. And we, of course, we got everybody. We got every, oh, Jesus Christ. Why can't you just send the right fucking guy to the right fucking plate? So uh, what could have been another run to tie the game. I try to make Dirty Kurt head back to second, and everybody's now batting the catcher, Harmony Strauss. That's what it is. All right, so we got to uh, substitute uh, Mr. Dirtbag is here, and as uh, we've done historically, we will put in Mr. Dirtbag. Number fifty. So we got the Dirtbag team. Gonna double up, and uh, the first one looks like Dirty Kurt might pull this one in. Out number one. Now batting the the Liner. Liner. Mr. RBI man has nobody hit in right now. And he's gonna hit it out, doesn't matter. He's gonna RBI himself. Home run against Maria Dirtbagus. Liner smashes it, like off 459 feet, his third home run. So now extends the lead again of the wide loads. Now batting the and Gaspar. Chimo Gaspar. One for three, facing a new pitcher for him. Swings and misses, strike number one. Checks that one. That's gonna be strike number two. That one goes, wow, that's a speedy one there. So, Water's gonna throw it to first, all the way over there. Now batting the center fielder, Fungo Akuro. Akuro, who's 0 for 3, with a runner on first, one away. The Bagus throws that one there uh, on the inside. That one does hit the strike zone at 77 miles per hour. That one's going up. It looks like Kapowie's headed for it. And takes it out. Out number two. Now batting the second Friedman. Baseman. Second baseman. Friedman. Got a double and a single out of three uh, at bats so far. See right. 82 mile an hour strike. That's high. 78 mile an hour too high ball. See right. 96. That one's hauling ass. So let's see. Slow it down a little bit. He does get a piece of that. And uh, heads it right out to center field. Reliable is going to pull that one in for out number three. Seven to five is the score. At the bottom of the seventh, the beer keggers are sending uh, Frogman Barbarian up first to try to recoup. Cug Burbany is the pitcher for the wide loads. Now batting, the so his last at bat here for Barbarian was a walk. That have been out. <laughs> He's gonna smash that one. Uh, it's going into the right fillers. No, it goes right back. Why didn't you run? Oh no, we went the wrong way. My fault. Could have got a double out of that one. But thanks to my uh, my fingers not reacting to what my brain told them to, which is not what happened when I tried to make the runners uh, advance the last time, by the way. Oh, and they try to pick off Barbarian at first. That's coming low on the outside, but his strike for beer, that's too low off the ground. I almost hit that one. It's a little too high. That would have been a pop out. All right, we're getting close there. Two and two. Beer, uh, well, is this going to be, yeah, it's going to probably be a double play. Oh, no, he got a play. The beer goes to second. I don't know if he gets to stay there, but he did head to second. They threw that shit out in the stadium. Or out in the stands. The beer makes it to second. Rusty Edge. Ah, oh, he hits that one to third. I don't know. Okay, so beer. Gonna slide into third in scoring position. Try to do something with the score. Cywinder Kapawi. Gonna try to hit him in. Two outs. That's that's gonna do it. Kapawi on first. Beer scores eventually. One point uh, lead again now for the wide loads. Now batting the third baseman, 
So here's Mariana Beer, who's fallen behind in the game. He's gonna crush that one. Is that, yep, that's gonna be good. That's gonna be good for a double, potentially. If we can get Sidewinder in. Oh shit, nope, yep, we'll just get everybody back. I don't think Sidewinder had the speed. It would've been a close call. So instead of risking an out to end the uh, inning here, Bourbonese out and Bozer's in for the pitching staff for Darren Big Sauce. And that's just off the outside tip of the bat, and that's gonna end it though. Beer Keggers did creep back up there. Still trailing by one, by one, and Ella Royds will be the first now up. The right fielder, Ella Royds. He does have a strikeout, I believe. Doesn't say there. I thought it was a strikeout against Chris Dirt Baggis. Right. Gonna start by swinging at that one and missing. We may have to use more pitchers as this is the uh, championship. And Monty Hinkie's gonna call and pull in the first out there. Royd in the dugout. Prince Prize. Some amazing play out there at right field, uh, correction, left field. His first at bat, looks like of the entire uh, playoffs. Sitting at two strikes now. Same as that one goes foul. It goes straight in the air. Dirty Kurt eyes for it and catches it for out number two. The first baseman. Nasha Dunga. Nasha, three for four right now in the game. Punches that one out where nobody is standing. Rusty and reliable are running for it, going to second. The beer can't pick it up again. For some reason, it just rolls to him and he's like, where did it go? He can't see it. It has to be in the air for him, I guess. Here's Hicks, 0 for four. Goes right to Beer, he's gonna pick that one up, throw it off the first, and that's out number three. Thankfully, the Keggers held at the top of the eighth, the wide loads to zero. Reliable's up first, he's sitting one for three, it's not reliable. He did sacrifice himself on the last one that to get a run in, so. Well, that's going to be reliable, and that's going to put him on first now towards second. He should make it, and he does. So much so, he started head to third. Now back. All right, so the pressure's on now for Big Slick. Two singles in RBI today. Uh, two for four on the day. Reliable's on second. That goes right over the top of second base. So Big Slick's going to second. Reliable's headed home. Big Slick stops as the cutoff man at short. Goes at the third. But Big Slick with an RBI tying the game right now. Seven up. Dirty Kurt, one for four with his last good one being a double. Big Slick's on second. They'll have the healthy lead. Dirty Kurt's, ah, <laughs> yeah, too much weight. Put everything into it, and man, didn't come close. One and one. That's a shitty ball there, but that's down the line. Goes right down, oh no. So Dirty Kurt, again, he goes to first, gets tagged out on the, I mean, that was a, that was a crappy hit, but it did put Big Slick on third. So if Barbarian can get an RBI here, and he does try to crush it, just not, he's not fast enough there. He does it again. That's a high ball, so now two strikes. Where are you going? No! Get down! What the hell are you doing? Still in home? Well, now you can go home. The Barbarian goes the first. Big slip comes in, and finally, the Beer Caggers have a lead. For the first time today, the Beer Caggers with one up on the wide load. Here's big uh, old man beer. Yeah, he's not paying attention. He's just swinging. Nope, one and one now for beer. He does like that one. That's going to get caught. Nope, it's not. So beer's going to second. Prize is sending that in. And whoever that is is going to head home. Oh, I caught him. I could have made it. Oh, no. We got a double pickle going on again. So beer's on second. 
And then we got uh, Frogman Barbarian who started that pickle on third. He makes it, makes it back. And now Rusty has a chance to uh, help out here. And he yeah, goes off the wall. But Rusty's headed to second. Rusty may make it, and he does. An R, that's two RBIs for Rusty. And now the, the beer keggers are starting to come through. So I went to everyone, as uh, one out, runner on second. Kapowie hits that out in the hole between center and right. So Kapowie with another RBI gets a double herself. As she, uh, you know, just kind of just walks up the second while the ball's in play. Like, hey, here I am. Okay, now we're getting a little bit of breathing room, a four point lead now. Mariana Beer is batting. Hits that one too soon, sends it foul into the dugout. That's a strike, come on. He has to hit that one, because that started curving. Uh, Mariana's gonna make it, oh! If she just had stretched out just a tiny bit more, he may have saved that one, but she is out, and now there's, uh, Powie's on third. Uh, Kapowie stays on third. <laughs> yeah, that don't, not a good idea to run there, Cy Wondered. Big Sauce uh, smashes that one out. Uh, it's probably going to get caught, so Kapowie's run does not count. But hey, top of the ninth, the wide loads are now trailing by four. So it's really up to the beer keggers here to hold them to three or less in order to win the game. This is the last at bat for the wide loads unless they tie the game. Maria Dirt Bagus is gonna start it off here. Since the first one in uh, kind of fast. 82 miles an hour in that change up. Uh, two swings, two misses. That one goes, uh, she does connect with that. It goes straight in the air here. Dirty Kurtz calling for it, waiting for it to come down. That's out number one. There's two more outs the remaining of the game. The game number one of the championships. Liner, who has a home run already. Watches that one go by. That's 82 mile an hour fastball strike. That's in there as well. Strike number two. He is gonna punch that right out to Big Slick. Now two outs, ladies and gentlemen. Two outs. The last, uh, the last at bat, the wide loads. Two away, Gaspar has a chance to do something with one strike. That's two, damn it. Oh, damn. So Dirt Baggis sends that one right in there. Here we go. Strike out, Dirt Baggis. Gaspar is out of here in the game. Some hell, one hell of a comeback for the beer keggers. And they win game number one of the champions. The championship, the World Series, if you will. The beer keggers with a four point lead win the game. Here's all the totals. They had two home runs and we had one. Bunch of pitchers. And uh, the top three is actually from the White Loads, Marsha Donga. And then we have Big, uh, Darren Big Sauce and Rusty Edge are coming in at the top three for the beer keggers. And as we go over here to the season hub, we know that game two is now headed to the wide loads uh, who are now sitting 0-1 on the series. We have uh, Latoya Lumberg will be pitching. We already know their players. We know our players. Jeanette Dreyer will be pitching for us at that next game. So we're going to have to wait a few days for that one to kick off. It may be Thursday. Uh, no, actually, it'll be probably be Tuesday. Maybe we'll do it on Tuesday.